How to install MandFX ROM based on MIUI 12 on the Xiaomi POCO F1. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install the MandFX ROM based on MIUI 12 on the Xiaomi POCO F1. Before you ask me, what is this light blinking and how do you enable this feature? Well, this is the proximity sensor and it blinks. There is no way to enable this feature. What are the prerequisites for this video? The prerequisites for this video are you need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have to up recovery installed. How do you do that? I have separate videos for both of those which are linked in the description of the video. Next thing, make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60%. Do not, and I repeat, do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30%. Also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device because if we run into any boot loops then we'll have to do a format data from to up recovery in which case you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next thing you need to know is whether your device is encrypted or not but before that as you can see I am running MIUI global stable version 11.0.6.0 based on Android 10 on my POCO F1. So you do need to know whether your device is encrypted or not. For that, we'll go into settings and then you will go into password and security, privacy, as you can see, encryption and credentials, phone not encrypted. Why do we need to know this? Well, we need to know this because based on the fact whether you are encrypted or not, you will have to flash disable force encryption. And that brings us to the topic that what are the files which we need. So you need only two files. The first one is the MANDFX ROM based on MIUI 12 for the POCO F1. And then if your device is not encrypted, again, if your device is not encrypted, then you need disable force encryption. If your device is encrypted, then you do not need disable force encryption. Next thing we need to do is we'll go into settings, password and security, remove password, fingerprint unlock and face unlock once that is done we will go back scroll down go into me account and remove your me account once that is done go back go into account sensing and remove your google account once you have removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once just to double check and to ensure that all the accounts and security measures have been removed successfully why are we removing all these accounts and security measures well we're going from one ROM to another and I don't want you to be locked out of your own device. Next thing, we need to boot into to up recovery. For that, the first thing we need to do is turn off our device. Once the device has turned off, we're going to press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see the to up recovery boot logo. Once we have booted into to up recovery, we're going to wipe, advanced wipe, select Dalvik cache, system, vendor and data. If you do not get the option for vendor, you're using the wrong version of to up recovery i've linked the version which i use in the description of this video next thing swipe to wipe once that is done we will click on the home button go into install and now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the mandfx rom zip file and disable force encryption in case you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder in my case i have transferred them manually so they are in the root directory first file which we need to select is the MANDFX ROM for the POCO F1, select the file and then swipe to confirm flash. An important thing to note over here is that MANDFX ROM is rooted out of the box. As you can see, it is installing Magisk and there is no way around it. So fair piece of warning, the ROM is pre-rooted. Once all the files have flashed successfully, click on the home button. And now if your device was not encrypted, again, if your device was not encrypted, then we need to flash disable force encryption for that first thing going to mount mount vendor in case it is already mounted you need not do anything click on the home button go into install and then we need to flash the disable force encryption file select the file and then swipe to confirm flash once that is done we will click on the home button and then all you need to do is go into reboot and select system however if you run into any boot loops or any encryption issues then you'll have to boot back into to up recovery by pressing and holding volume up and power button at the same time till you see the to up recovery boot logo then you'll go into wipe format data type in yes click on the check mark button on the bottom right of the keyboard for now we're going to skip that step we'll go to the home screen reboot and then select system 
and bam there it is we have the me boot animation on our poco f1 which means our device is booting into man fx rom based on me ui 12 the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen here is the list of languages which are baked into this rom feel free to pause the video as i scroll through to see if your language is present or not And now let me skip the initial setup real quick and there it is we are on the home screen we can go into settings and this is where you will find all the customizations of manned fx rom they do have a vip version in case you want to become a vip it gives you additional features but the free version also works absolutely fine you can go into my device here it is this is the current version miui 12 20.5.3 beta device name is poco f1 and these are the apps which come baked in with this build and of course you do have magisk so as i mentioned earlier the rom is pre-rooted and you do have play store and google assistant baked in as well along with the new health application and your notes me video file managers so there it is peeps that is how you install manned fx rom based on miui 12 on your poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you